Well, hello everyone. It is Friday, April the 15th, 2022. I'm Doug, and it's time once again to Quartle. Uh, last time we ended with Trend, Lowly, Death, and Lusty. Goodness gracious. Um, well, uh, at the risk of being a little weird, I think we're going to try Lusty Death as our opener today. Uh, just, just work with me. Work with me, folks. Uh, let's see what that gets us. Lusty. Okay, we got T and the Y at the end on the first puzzle in position. Uh, and Death. Okay, uh, so that actually gave us a little bit to work with. Of course, on the first puzzle, we know that the word will end in T-Y. There's an A somewhere. Uh, it could be something like, um, mm, could be could be party. <laughs> uh, could be party. I've noticed, I don't know if it's intentional. I almost feel like there's kind of a weird theme lately in the quartal words. Uh, I don't know. Could just be me. Could just be me. Um, anyhow, let's find something that's uh, going to be a good e evaluation word. Uh, let's see. How about, I almost feel like we should be able to get five unique letters here. Um, uh, G -R oh, we do groin, G-R-O-I-N. That'll get us the O and the I. Uh, and it'll get, yeah, you know what? Uh, definitely groin. Definitely uh, groin. Uh, okay, so that. Uh, again, looking back at that first puzzle, uh, we have four letters now. There's T and the Y in the end. There is an R and an A. Um, again, it keeps it keeps uh, making me think that that word is party. The more I the more I see, the more I think that I'm convinced that that is actually party. Uh, I let me just take a quick peek at what else we got going on here. Uh, we have D A. D, E, A, and G, all in different positions here. Uh, we evaluated R, so it's not grade. Um, okay. Uh, I wonder if it's <laughs> wonder if it's adage, A, D, A, G, E. That's always a possibility. Um, not much with the L, U, and the A in different positions. And over here at the end, we have G, L, U, and N. Uh, could be flung. Could be flung. Uh, that's a possibility. Uh, so, you know, I'm wondering if it makes sense to strategically come up with something that has uh, an F and a P in it uh, for a fourth word. Uh, so let's see. If I did, mm, I don't need any help with Y, so puffy isn't necessarily going to be the best way to go. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to have... I don't know if I'm going to be able to, uh, hmm, yeah, I might not be able to get that. But the more I think about it, I just can't see myself going wrong with party. I think I'm going to take the leap of faith on this one. I'm, I'm not seeing a case where I end up being wrong about this. So I'm going to go with party here. Ooh, well, I was wrong. But I did get the A in the right spot. Uh, I did get the A in the right spot. Uh, and we know that the R is in the first spot. So, okay. So, R-A. What is... It could be ratty? That's... Boy, these are... These have been some strange scenarios here in Quartal lately. Uh, ratty? Maybe. Okay. Well, uh, we're running low on... Uh, free guesses here. If I take one more evaluation guess, I'm going to have to run the table. Um, hmm. <laughs> uh, we were thinking about flung. Uh, so what can I do that would get me at least F and something else here? Uh, boy, oh boy, oh boy. Uh, if I did crumb, um, I would still be leaving the F out on the table, but hmm, boy, I'm in a bit of a pickle here. Definitely in a bit of a pickle. Um, hmm, uh, you know, the other thing that's interesting is in the second puzzle. So the the two constants I have are not in the front, so I feel like there's probably going to be. A, uh, a caged is very interesting, right? 
caged is super interesting. So evaluating the C could break this open in the sense that I could definitely figure out at least the second puzzle. Uh, let's see. If I evaluate something with F and C and my instincts are right, I get two and four figured out, uh, and I still have a good idea on the first. So I think if we're going to... If we're going to go with one more evaluation where it's got to have at least F and C. Uh, so let's see. Can I think of something where I can get something else to come along for the ride as well? Uh, if I used frac, I would get F, C, and K, uh, which would be nice. Um, yeah, that might be as good as it's going to get in terms of fact gathering. All right, let me make sure that that's going to be considered a word it is so that will confirm my suspicions on both the second and the fourth puzzle yeah uh so it in, in, if i'm right about the first one we'd only have one mystery left and we'd also have three consonants potentially giving us help on the third so we're gonna have to run the table after this but i think this is as good as it's gonna get so give me frack Oh, wow. Neither the... It was not caged. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh, well, we do have... Okay, hold on. On the fourth puzzle, we do have flung. So let's just take what we can get here. We have flung. Uh, now we have... The F came along on the third puzzle is part of this situation. So we have F A, F L A U. Uh, the L and the F are not in the first spot. So, um, hmm. Wow. Okay. Uh, what would make sense here? Uh, a. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, uh, I'm going to come back to that one. <laughs> um, going over here, we know that the... I still feel like there is going to be something A-G waged. Is that is that a valid word? It is a valid word. Oh, my goodness. I'm confident in it being A-G-E-D. Um Maged is not a word, right? No. Okay. So it would have to be waged. Yeah, I feel like it's got to be waged. I can't imagine it's not. I mean, we're putting our we're putting our game on the line because we have no room for error. But I can't I can't imagine that it's not waged. So all right, let's take let's roll the dice. No, it's not. Oh, and we're not going to solve today's quartal. Oh my goodness, what the heck is going on here? Well, um okay, well, well for for the runner up thing, we do have all five letters here. F L U A W. Uh so let's just let, at least get this sorted out. Uh A F L A U W. Okay, hold on, let's think. It's not F, L, or W, so it starts with an A or a U. All right, so if it starts with an A, uh, and, and let's just put uh, uh, F, uh, L, U, W. Oh, you know what? Here's the word that's a commentary on how I've been playing this. Awful. <laughs> okay, awful. Yeah, okay, it has to be that. So we'll take that, uh, and let's see if we at least get the three of the four, right? So we have uh, A, T, Y, uh, and I keep coming back to Ratty, R-A-T-T-Y. Uh, so we're going to get three of the four, and uh, we'll find out in a moment what the second puzzle was. So, all right, let's get the reveal. Did we at least get three of the four? Uh, no shame on this one. This was tough. So it was Ratty. Ratty, Awful, Flung, and Badge. It was badge. Oh, my goodness. Ah, so we missed this one today. 
Uh, close, but no cigar. Three out of the four. The old saying, you can't win them all, folks. <laughs> but I think we gave it a solid effort today. Uh, folks, I hope you did enjoy watching. Please comment uh, with your experiences on this one uh, below. Give us your strategies. Of course, like and subscribe if you are being entertained by this and enjoy it. Appreciate you helping us grow the channel. We'll be back. Jump right on the horse and give it another go tomorrow for some more Quartal.